I'm here with Polly Lit, and he's ready to sing for you. He's going to sing, Yesterday I Heard the Rain, and you're going to love it. Here he is. Hey, Noah, how you doing? This is a song by uh, one of my favorites. His name is Tony Bennett, probably one of the best. Yesterday I heard the rain Whispering your name Asking where you'd gone It fell softly from the clouds On the silent crowds As I wandered on Out of doorways black umbrellas came to pursue me faceless people as they passed were looking through me no one knew me yesterday I shut my eyes Face up to the skies, drinking in the rain. But your image still was there, floating in the air, brighter than a flame. Yesterday I, I saw a city full of shadows. Without pity, and I heard the steady rain whispering your name, whispering your name. Forget the gym fees and expensive equipment and high cost personal trainer. The ultimate mind and body workout can be done right from the comforts of home. Today, Pilates expert Nicole Stewart shows us moves that will give you a long, lean body in just 15 minutes a day using ordinary household items. Hi, Nicole. Hi. So tell me, what is Pilates and what are the benefits? Pilates is a conditioning exercise. It stretches and strengthens and lengthens the muscles in your body. It also improves flexibility, posture, and your abdominal strength. Now, I've seen Pilates equipment in the gym, and I'm sorry, but they look like torture devices. Ah, it's called a reformer. That's what you're talking about. But everything you can do on the reformer, you can do on the mat. Oh, okay. I'm definitely embracing the mat today. So, what about these? Are we working out today, or are we eating lunch? So, if you don't have any weights around the house, and you want to get a little extra weight in your hands, you can use soup cans, you can use water bottles. So the first exercise we're doing is called Hug a Tree. I happen to have a little weights here. So you're going to sit Indian style. You're going to reach your arms out to the side. Good. You're going to breathe. You're going to take a big inhale. And you're going to exhale. And you're going to close your arms together and think you're grabbing around a big, round tree trunk. Good. And again, inhale and open wide. And exhale. Squeeze in. So you can do this 10 to 15 times. You can also do it without any weights. If you want a little extra burn, you're going to do some arm circles, down and around. Ten times. This is really good for any flab on the back of your arms. So, hugging a tree can actually be good for you. The next exercise is called the roll-up. So, what you're going to do is you're going to trade out the soup cans for the steering wheel. Absolutely. It's actually called the magic circle. So, you lay down on your back, extend your legs the length of the mat. Good. And you're going to roll all the way down and press into that wheel. Reaching your arms all the way back, really lengthen your body. If you're going to bring your arms forward, tuck your chin to your chest, scooping your abdominals in, and stretch. Good. This may be my favorite new exercise. Good. Well, I'm going to show you one more exercise, Faith. So the third move is single leg stretch. So you're going to come up into your seeker. You're going to really lift up, pull your abdominals in, lift your opposite leg up and you're going to switch legs slowly, inhaling and exhaling. Try not to let your knee bend at all. You're going to get more of a stretch that way. Good. If you want a little more burn, flex your foot and pull your leg in twice. Pull, pull, and switch. Boy, that is more of a stretch. Good. And your eye line should be your belly button. Okay. 
So how many times a week should we incorporate Pilates into our fitness routine? As many times as you can, but two to three times would be sufficient. Two to three, we can do that, right? I feel fabulous. Thank you so much, Nicole. You're welcome. My pleasure. Fit. Pilates. Let's recap the three ways we can get a Pilates mat workout right at home. First, work the arms and your breath by hugging the tree. Second, stretch that body and work the abs with the roll-up. And third, challenge your abs and stretch your legs with single leg stretches. Today's workout proves that practicing Pilates doesn't require expensive equipment or costly gyms. Use the comforts of home to help keep the body fit and the mind clear. to be aware how patients are diagnosed, who's being treated for what, and how the different wards separate them. Did Abby test this in a moment? I understand how this can be traumatic. If your father hasn't been a patient here. My father killed himself when I was nine years old. I've been waiting a long time to do this. Okay, everyone listen up. We have a code orange. A high-risk patient is coming through right now. Everyone turn and face the wall. You do not make eye contact until we tell you that it's all clear. One more guy, they all know this. self-amusing here. Kelly's getting concerned for the live audience that's been bust in for the evening. I pay for being married to Hope. You must really love Hope. Mm. I think this is yours. The man with the backpack is actor Kevin Sorbo, who played Hercules. For this guest appearance, <laughs> they've given him a fake beard. You're making me eat it again, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Just half his beard came off at the table. <laughs> How can that be? 